I'm here with Misha, a member of our Synopsys R&D team. In this demonstration, we're talking about how our Embedded Vision 6X vision processor with Deep Learning Engine can offload the, the workload from an um, application processor, saving power and increasing performance. Specifically, in this case, Android. Misha, can you tell us more? Yeah, sure. Um, thanks, Gordon. So, what we see here is a host system uh, that runs Android, and in this case, it's Android 8.1, Oreo. And starting from Android 8.1, there is this new feature which is called the Neural Network API, which allows uh, uh, people to offload their neural network workloads to accelerators such as the GPU, but also application-specific accelerators like our EV61 plus CNN 880 processor. So what we have here is the TensorFlow Lite uh, camera demo app that anyone can download from the internet. It's open source. And we adjusted it a little bit to have this uh, Synopsys logo and a knob to turn on and off uh, the EV61 acceleration. So it's running MobileNet? It's running MobileNet uh, 224. And basically what this does, it is uh, classifying uh, the image that you see here. And it gives you the most likely uh, categories. So as you can see, it's running at about 60 uh, milliseconds. It takes 60 milliseconds to do to classify one image. And that's running on the, on, on the FPGA system here. So uh, 61.5 megahertz. So if I turn it off, uh, it will be running on the CPU fallback engine on the host. And you will see the inference time shoot up to around 400 milliseconds, even though this is running at one gigahertz. In the actual uh, processor, uh, your EV61 accelerator will not run at 60 megahertz. Uh, so we have extrapolated and at a sweet spot for power and performance, 800 megahertz, you will uh, run close to 200 frames per second. You can also go uh, to a lower frequency to save even more power. Great. Thank you, Mission. So for more information, visit the Synopsys website. Thank you very much.